Welcome everyone. In this part, we will know what is a domain name, what is hosting and how you get your own domain and hosting. So after end of this part, you will have your own domain and hosting. I'm excited as you were. So in this part, we will discuss about domain name, web hosting and how you get your own domain and hosting up to 60% discount through my special link. So what is a domain name? We all use Facebook, right? What do you do to browse Facebook? You need to go your browser first and type www.facebook.com. And what do you do if you want to buy something from Amazon? You need to go to your browser first and type www.amazon.com. So this www.facebook.com is the domain name of Facebook and amazon.com is the domain name of Amazon. Similarly, www.jimfahaddigital.com is my domain name. Basically, a domain name is just the address to your website. So think of the internet as a vast map full of avenues and streets and turns everywhere. And think of your website as your house. In order for anyone to find their way to your house, even you will need an address so people can find you that's unique. This address is your domain name. Every website has an IP and an IP is just seemingly random string numbers. So when you register and purchase a domain name, it's almost like saving your home address as home into your phone. It gives that IP addresses a simple way to remember name that anyone can type in and get to your website. This is because it would be really difficult to remember a random string of numbers every time you want to go to your website or amazon.com or whatever website you want to go. Let's say jimfahaddigital.com. You can remember that because it's simple and easy to remember rather than 892.145.888.999 that kind of crazy numbers, right? Let's say you type in jimfahaddigital.com. Whenever you hit enter, your computer sends a request to a bunch of servers that makes up the DNS and DNS just stands for domain name system. This domain name system looks up the correct IP address and just points your computer into the right direction all within less than a millisecond. Wow, the internet is a magical place. So that's what a domain name is and a little bit about how it works. What is web hosting? Web hosting is basically a really fast computer or server where all the information of your website are stored or hosted. Your images, your texts, informations, your blog post, articles, everything. So when people enter your website and they see all the images, texts, information, these all are actually stored on that server, on that computer. So simply domain, that's your unique human readable website address, like Apple have apple.com, Amazon have amazon.com, I have jimfahaddigital.com and hosting is simply where your all website information will be stored. Now it's time to get your own domain and hosting. So if we want to get a domain name and web hosting, we go to jimfahaddigital.com and hit enter. I will provide the link in the description so you don't have to type manually and then go to web hosting. And here you can see my number one recommendation for WordPress web hosting is Bluehost. So if we click the get started button from our website, you will get a discount around 60%. So why Bluehost? In my opinion, Bluehost is the best web hosting provider. I am a web developer. I tried so many other web hosting companies. I don't want to mention their name, but I personally ended up using Bluehost hundreds of my clients using Bluehost and they never complain about using it. If you see my Bluehost account, I have hosted here tons of websites and I never get a downtime. 
their customer support is really amazing in case if you need any help. And that's why I always recommend Bluehost and their price is really affordable for everyone. So now click on get started. You can see their pricing. So you have different options based on what you need. If it's your first website and you only want to host one website then you can take their basic plan. And if you have multiple websites, more than one, you can pick their plus or choice plus options. Though both options are almost same, choice plus has some domain privacy and site backup features but we don't necessarily need that. And you can take their pro plan if you are planning to host a big e-commerce website or if you have millions of visitors already. As a beginner, let's start with the basic plan. It will cost you only $2.95 per month and we will get one website, 15 GB of SSD storage, unmetered bandwidth, free SSL certificate, standard performance, one included, five parked and 25 subdomains. So in that price, these are awesome. But in future, if you have multiple websites, you can upgrade it to their plus plan. So basically you can upgrade or downgrade your plan anytime. Now let's click on select. Now we will select our domain name and if you have a domain name already, you can enter your existing domain name here and you can set up that. I'm assuming you don't have a domain name already. So let's select our domain name. On the right side, you see there are options .com, .online, .site or .info. I always suggest to take .com websites because it's good for search engine optimization and also .com website look more professional and legit. Now let's say we want to take apple.com. So type apple and click on next. It says unable to continue the domain apple.com cannot be used on Bluehost. Please try a different name. Because we all know apple.com is Apple's official website, we can take that. So you can put your name here or your business name or your brand name here. So for the sake of this tutorial, let's try for something like our elementor.com and click next. The domain our elementor.com is available. Awesome. Now here you need to put your account information, your first name, last name, business name, country, street address, city, state, zip code, phone number, email address and this email address is really important so make sure you are putting your best email address because after completing purchase a receipt will send to that email address. So now I am putting my information here, my first name Jim, last name Fahad, my business name Jim Fahad digital i'm selecting my country here i'm from bangladesh my street address city my postal code here my phone number and here is my email address elementor at jimfahaddigital.com now here is the package information by default it's selected for 36 months that means for three years if you now see the price is 249 dollar but let's see how we can reduce the price we only take the necessary things for starting you can take it for one year it would cost you four dollar 95 cents per month that is still pretty cheap so let's select 12 months price now go to package extras you can select or deselect domain privacy. Having domain privacy is good, so no one can get to know who is the owner of the website. But I'm deselecting it because I want to be transparent and it's not that important to me at this moment. Turn it off. And I don't need site lock security and code guard basic either, so I'm deselecting those as well. You see the price is now $59 only for the full year. That's awesome. Now here's the payment information. I'm putting my MasterCard number here, my CVV code and expiration date. Now select this. So you are agreed with their terms and policy. 
And when you complete purchasing through my link, you see you are getting a huge discount and I will also get a commission. So nothing extra, that's a win-win situation. Thank you for that because it supports this channel and helps me to make more valuable videos like this for you. So now click on submit. It says your purchase was a success. We sent a confirmation email to elementor at gymfahaddigital.com. So I'm waiting for their confirmation email. And here's the receipt. So they will send it also on my email and you will also get that on your email. So let's create on create account. Now let's create our Bluehost account from here. Our domain name we already have selected our elementor.com. Now create password. Now I am here putting my password and retype the password here again. Now click I have read and agree to Bluehost privacy policy and terms service. Let's click create account. Your account is ready to go. Now you can log in. So click on go to login. And you see I get already email from Bluehost to confirm my purchase. Let's now check our email and confirm our purchase. So here we get already three email from Bluehost. First email is for confirming our account. So let's just click on verify your email. So our account is now verified. Let's close this. And here is our Bluehost login area. Here login to your account. Hosting login, yes. Domain name, our domain name, our elementor.com and password. Let's put the password. Is the password we chose a few times ago. So let's click on login. For now, just click on I'm not creating a website because I will walk you through everything how you can do that by yourself. So just skip this all here. Get started. We don't need anything. Turn off domain privacy protection. I don't want privacy because I, we don't need that for now. So we have successfully completed purchasing our domain and hosting. And here is Jim Fahad. I'm a professional web developer. I've been developing websites for my clients for more than 10 years now. Even if you want me to make your amazing website, no matter if you need a blog website or business website or e-commerce website, just go to jimfahaddigital.com forward slash pro services. I will put that link in the description or if you want to make your website by yourself then you can watch my step-by-step -step full website creation tutorial it's almost a five hour long free youtube tutorial go ahead thank you for watching please give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe because a lot more things coming in this channel all about website creation wordpress blogging how to profit from your website of course you don't want to miss any of that so please make sure you hit that big red subscribe button see you soon bye bye